I'm Danish Bari and I teach physicians in developing countries through workshops and online courses. I have a six months online movement disorder mini fellowship that I, that's a certificate program through University of Nebraska Medical Center. I have trained 30 neurologists in that program so far in the last three years and currently we have nine physicians enrolled. I have been given the best international teacher award by Pakistan Society of Neurology and I've been given an impact in education award for innovation in education by University of Nebraska Medical Center, a multi-college campus-wide award. I'm the associate program director for movement disorder fellowship and I'm the curriculum director for neurology residents and I run a blended learning course for movement disorders for our neurology residents. I love teaching. This is what I do and this is why I'm here. I have a strong interest in teaching and education in neurology and especially in movement disorders for physicians online. I'm Dr. Naveed Alam. I am FCPS in Neurology. I passed my FCPS in 2015 and I am currently working as consultant neurologist Allied Hospital Faisalabad and doing my daily private clinic in Faisalabad. Actually it was two reasons. I had a personal interest in movement disorders and uh, it was the field I was uh, lacking during my training uh, in uh, FCPS for three years in Neurology. This was the field that I felt it was deficient in our training. So I had a personal interest for it also. That's why I uh, pursued for this course. My name is Dr. Danish Nebi. Um, I'm actually a senior resident uh, doing my training in neurology at the Lerini Hospital Peshawar. And um, it's actually my final year of uh, training uh, going on there. So we in the second uh, batch of uh, the mini, mini fellowship in the movement disorders and uh, before coming uh, uh, and participating in the fellowship um, I had very minimal experience in uh, diagnosing uh, the movement disorders and managing them. Um, we do not have a proper uh, uh, specialization or training here in movement disorders. So it was a very good experience um, learning a different phenomenologies at first and uh, then um, how to manage them. Um, um, it increased uh, a lot um, um, in my knowledge. We are not actually movement disorder specialist. Uh, that's actually two years of uh, special, uh, specialization post fellowship. But I think most of the cases uh, we have learned uh, from daily lectures, from uh, weekly assignments, we have learned major cases, important cases uh, in our outdoor clinic. My name is Dr. Imjad Hussain and I am a family physician with special interest in neuropsychiatry. I am working at Ali Ahmad Khan Hospital, Jhang. I have been a participant of this course in movement disorder, uh, mini fellowship in movement disorder by Dr. Danish Bhatti. It has been, an, it has been a beautiful course and uh, we were supposed to complete uh, six months of intensive assignments and we were supposed to uh, give timely submission of assignments and uh, we, we were supposed to learn new skills in, including movement disorder examinations and patient evaluations and we were taught uh, uh, many difficult concepts like atypical Parkinson disorders and uh, this course has been an introduction to a brand new science of movement disorder for uh, somebody like me. I think this course is going to help us a lot. The most challenging part, I guess I would uh, I'd be saying that um, it was not easy uh, because uh, you had to um, um, fully participate in that. You had to uh, see all the lectures, the assignments um, uh, you have, uh, they were given on a weekly basis and um, uh, preparing the, uh, seeing a lecture, preparing assignments and the quizzes and um, um, uh, to see uh, all those, uh, what has been going on uh, on the group of the movement disorders. Uh, keeping up with that, uh, it required some time from your daily routine and uh, it was not um, much easy, but, but it was interesting. Movement Disorders course was uh, very challenging actually. I had three kids, I had uh, morning duty from 8 to 2 in government job and then my clinic uh, from 5 p.m. to 11 p.m. And uh, it was very difficult to submit assignments on time and hear all the online lectures. It was difficult for me. Uh, 
I am Dr. Ali Hassan, uh, working as an associate professor in neurology, Isra University Hospital, Hyderabad. It was not easy for me to uh, do the very hard task uh, and complete the assignments of this course. Uh, being working as a very busy schedule, academic and clinic and hospital. But Alhamdulillah, uh, I, with the encouragement of my other colleagues and the, the teacher, Dr. Danish, uh, we fulf I fulfilled my all assignments. Uh, well, um, uh, as I said before, uh, before joining uh, the Movement Disorder Camp, uh, I barely had much knowledge about the Movement Disorders. Uh, it was my secondary residency as well. Uh, but as I participated in the Movement Disorder course, um, um, I started to notice more um, even first of all, I started to notice the um, basic movement disorder cases and then the variation in those cases um, and then managing those cases and even um, after um, um, the movement disorder workshops, uh, I had uh, also the opportunity to do, um, do uh, Botox in supervised under supervision in some cases as well. Mini fellowship was uh, very helpful for me actually. There were many cases, many cases, a lot of cases that were uh, we simply label them as the psychogenic movement disorders uh, because we do not know these uh, movement disorders. Uh, functional disorders we would label and uh, prescribe them antidepressants but after the mini fellowship uh, major cases we have uh, the whole burden of uh, movement disorder cases. Uh, we can now uh, diagnose them, can have a plan for them and uh, or uh, investigate them accordingly. The institution where I worked uh, in that institution, we usually deal, uh, was dealing the acute neurology cases and will get the less opportunity to see these movement disorder cases. So uh, this uh, area was always weak, I was feeling, uh, but by doing this, uh, the course, uh, I think I have improved my the skills and I hope uh, uh, this will give the benefit to the patient as well. Well, I sure would recommend this course because uh, we most of us uh, do lack in this um, field and uh, I would recommend it especially to all the neurologists um, but also to general physicians as well. They can also participate in it. But uh, to neurologists, um, I think they should um, participate in this course. It's highly recommended uh, for the people, uh, especially for to the young neurology who have passed the FCPS or MD in neurology. They must uh, get this uh, mini fellowship. It was very important. It was uh, very helpful. It will help in their future practice. Even if they are not uh, specializing in movement disorders, they, it will help in their general neurology practice also. Uh, I would strongly recommend to the, the youngsters especially, to they should uh, uh, come and join this course. Thank you. And I would recommend this course to a younger generation of neurologists. I think this course is going to help me in taking care of my patient as well as I think I can play a role as an educator in movement disorder and I, I think it's a beautiful experience. Uh, Dr. Danish Bhatti has been very helpful um, uh, throughout the course, uh, guiding us through different modules and um, um, whenever we con uh, uh, confronted any, dif any difficult case We'll upload a video of that and um, they're always uh, welcome questions of ours uh, regarding different issues and different questions and uh, he has been exceptionally I would say helpful uh, and friendly um, in this course and very creative in um, um, creating different modules and keeping uh, the different trainings intact and I would like um, um, surely recommend this course to um, different um, neurologists and other physicians as well. Thank you. Movement disorders uh was my passion. I am thankful to uh, Movement Disorders Society Pakistan and Dr. Danish for uh, this whole work that he has uh, um, done for the last six months to us. Thank you.